Tell, tell me about your company and, and what you what you do. Well, we've been around for like 30 years and we do a lot of green installs. So we have rain harvest systems, we have our living walls, and we do living walls for either production of veggies or for sedums, art, artsy type sure. of things. And we also use them for sound barriers. Oh. So we have several that are going in to create sound barriers next to roads. So they have a green living wall. That's right. Do you, is the the watering complicated for a system like that? No, it's built into it. We use a system called TechLine. Okay. And so it goes vertical in it. You can also we also build them where they have doors on the top, and then inside you can put organic material and we seed them with worms. Oh. And then the worms will eat the organic material and, and they make worm castings, and then the irrigation takes the castings, turns it into tea, and it fertilizes the unit. So That's... you could be purely organic with it. How, how tall have you built them so far? Uh, the biggest one is eight foot. Eight foot. That's yeah. about as workable as I imagine. Yeah, get. we, those are planted in the top and they have cascading type plants in the top. Oh, so a pyramid shape kind yeah. of. Yeah, well, no, it's rectangle, but it, the plants cascade down. Okay. From the top. So you can make nice screens that are green with them. I, I no one thinks about the vertical space. It's, it's good to see it farmed and being used. Well, and with the, the vegetables, if you, that can all be planted on both sides. And so we can grow 20 to 40 times the amount of produce in the same footprint Wow! as a normal garden. Now, the maintenance by the, the homeowner, is it very involved? Do they have to do a lot to keep it going? Nah, it's really easy to do. Yeah, well, there's like no weeds. You know, you don't have weeds to pull or anything like that. So it's, uh, it's very low maintenance. Is, is it all on a timer or do they have yeah, to? Yeah, the, the, it's held on a timer. It's a battery operated timer generally. So you don't, or you could include it in your normal irrigation system. It's just the wall requirement. The watering is a little more specific than a lawn or a regular garden. I so it's you. good to have it on its own standalone type of a system. Nice, nice. Well, I think you've got a very good product here. What's the name of your company? It's Daniel R. Gibbs, Botanical Studio. Daniel R. Gibbs, and you're based out of where? Here, in Santa Rosa. Santa Rosa. What's your phone number? It's 291-4237, area code 707. Gotcha. And you're Danny? I'm Daniel. Pleasure talking to you. Thank right. you.